Hey, good morning, Spanish River, and happy Friday. Mr. Delaney from the yearbook here, just as promised. Teacher superlative winners. Told you guys we'd let you know who you voted for, who the winners were this week. So here we go. Figured I'd use my smart board today. This is full disclosure. These are the actual votes who you voted for. We did have a couple popular teachers that uh, won a couple of categories. So we'll figure out how to do that in the yearbook. But like I said, full disclosure, we're gonna check it out, see who won what. So first of all, 495 of you voted. So thank you so much for that. Got really good response responses and uh, so let's go through the categories all right so first of all the colors uh, are here um, we're gonna see a lot of colors today uh, in the best dressed category we have uh, let's see here honorable mention is mr. Heinrichs with 28 votes coming in at six percent all right and uh, our runner-up is miss Davidson 33 votes 7.1 percent and you might guess who is going to get the winning uh, votes here? Mr. Nelson, 51 votes for best dressed, 11% of the votes. All right, motivational speaker. This was a very, very close one. Uh, and let me see if I can get this right. A couple honorable mentions. Uh, let's see. We got Mr. Turner, 5.2%. Great job. All right. And uh, another honorable mention, I believe, Coach Abby, 5.4%, 25 votes. All right, so uh, the runner-up in this category was none other than Mr. Kip, 32 votes, 6.9%. And uh, let's see, you guys probably know this, 8%. Miss Hernandez comes in with whopping 8%, 37 votes, motivational speaker, well-deserved. Next one is Kid at Heart. Okay, again, a couple of close ones here, but uh, we're gonna have, again, Coach Abby is gonna be there, 6.5%, 30 votes. Well done, honorable mention. And in second place, we're gonna have Mr. Moran, 7.8%, 36 votes. He's our runner up for Kid at Heart. Is there even, even, a, do I even need to push this? You guys know it, all right? So here we go, as voted by you, the students. Mr. Dobb, Kid at Heart is our winner, 48 votes, 10.3%, all right? So, and here's another close one. See a lot of colors on our wheel here, all right? But this is the comedian category. I think we had a three-way tie for honorable mention here. And uh, if I get this right, let me see here. Yeah, Mr. Moran, 20, he had 27 votes. Uh, Mr. Bazil had 27 votes. All right, and I believe Mr. Dobb uh, came in second place um, with uh, 33 votes. Comedian, well, you got this guy here. He thinks he's funny, apparently you guys do too. Mr. Divis, 9.4%. 43 votes voted for best comedian. I'll get through this pretty quickly. Uh, this one, man, oh man, what a landslide, the biggest winner out of anything, but it is the secretly talented category. Um, all right, so we had for honorable mention, Mr. Marks with 13 votes. Um, all right, our runner up is Miss Morano with 31 votes, secretly talented, and then to know him is to love him. You know it, Mr. Nelson. A whopping 70 votes, the biggest landslide we had. All right, that is the voting category. Ah, oh, teacher and therapist all in one. All right, let's make sure we're taking care of everything academically, emotionally, mentally, and these teachers help out for sure. You can see a lot of votes all across the board here. Um, all right, but some of our honorable mentions, I believe, Jessica Salzman came in as our honorable mention. Um, my own, Mrs. Delaney, all right, is our runner up for the uh, therapist and teacher all in one. 30 votes, <clears throat> way to go, Mrs. Delaney, 6.6%. But check it out, again, may tie in with our motivational speaker, she just does it all, all right? Ms. Hernandez is our therapist and teacher all in one. What a great job she does here at River. Most likely to never retire. Hmm, who could it be? Well, uh, whatever this category is, let, let's, let's take it one by one. Coach McEnroe, uh, he uh, came in, let's see. Yeah, honorable mention, Coach McEnroe. 
All right, we need to keep him here. He can't leave. I need him. Um, okay, uh, this category I think uh, had a runner-up with 28 votes, Mr. Turner and Coach Turner, um, and then you guys probably know it. Here we go. Most likely I'm ever retire. She's probably gonna kill me. Miss Shanti, the Shantinator. Yes, 28 votes, 6.3 percent. Most likely to never retire. Best decorated classroom. All right, honorable mention right here. We'll go to Miss Hernandez, way to go. Look how close this is, I don't know if you can see it, but at 8.5%, we've got Nicole Davidson. Miss Davidson comes in with 37 votes. Just topping her is going to be Miss Murano. 39 votes, congratulations. She does have a beautiful classroom. Go and check it out if you haven't done so already. This category, boy oh boy, look at the colors. Ultra caffeinated. All right, ultra caffeinated. Um, we have, let's see, I think coming in, um, Miss Jones had 17 votes. All right, Mr. Moran had 16 votes right there, honorable mention. Uh, if I can get that category, Miss Hernandez, uh, 4%, uh, 17 votes. But this little blue square is Miss Susel, 21 votes, the winner of the ultra caffeinated. But you can see we all had a little bit of a slice of that pie. All right, next category. Most likely to be mistaken for a student. Honorable mention is Mr. Torres. I'm a little jealous how young, youthful some of you guys look. Uh, all right, and then our runner-up in that category, Miss Kennedy, right here from the English department. And another English department superhero, Miss Davidson, is the winner of most likely to be mistaken for a student. Again, I'm a little jealous, but that's okay. All right, most passionate about their job. Again, big colors in the wheel. I can just kind of scroll through, see them all. Uh, but let's do our honorable mention, Mr. Kip, passionate about his classes, as you guys know. Mr. Hernandez, of course, of course, of course. And the most passionate is the one, the only, Kevin Turner, there he is, Mr. Turner. 26 votes, 5.7%, all right, and that wraps up all of the multiple choice selections for this, okay? The rest were the partners in crime. We had to tally them up. There's a lot of them. Honorable mention, Mrs. Delaney and Mr. Delaney. Thank you guys to vote for that. Runner up was Callan Burke. You knew that was gonna happen. And do I even need to say it? I wish they were here. All right, Divis and Dobb won the Partners in Crime. So we're gonna get those in the yearbook. Make sure to order a yearbook, all right? If you haven't ordered one yet, again, yearbookordercenter.com, that's where you do it. Make sure to go ahead and place that order today. All right, there are limited copies available, so please make sure to do that, all right? No matter what grade you are. Um, this and so much more information can be found on our Facebook page. Seniors, cap and gown portraits are available. If you want to buy them from Katie Studios, you can go right there and do it. Uh, all right, and yearbook applications are also available. So if you want to apply to be on next year's staff, you can see we have a lot of fun. Make sure to go ahead and do it. All right, here's more about that. Check it out. 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 Check it out.